the Dodge D-150, <laughs> the, the, the Dodge Ram pickup that, you, that your, grand, your grandparents used to ride in, each, each day uh, going up and down the road, made just to get groceries, made to do the hardest jobs possible, get the job done, and yeah. Maybe, maybe you yourself as a kid may have uh, sat in the back of one. Maybe sat in the bed of the bed of the truck just riding down the road. Maybe your grandparents told tales of owning the, an old Dodge D-150 <coughs> and how good of a truck it was. But you ever wonder if it was uh, a race car? If you could actually race these? That's what we we're going to find out in this video. Because <coughs> I'm going to set a Corsa back with another Nordschleit video here the race a Dodge D-150 but there's a bit of a catch as you will see in a second the Dodge D-150 that we were given with is this <laughs> what? <laughs> oh my god what is going on guys, Graham Cracker Gaming here back with another video, and <clears throat> this is a Dodge D-150, not just any D Dodge D-150, not just any old Ram D-150, this is a D-150 special. <laughs> um, <clears throat> so we're back with another <laughs> Nordschleit video, I can't get... Can't get over this car, holy shit! And you'll find out in a bit too why. But this is an old, but this is a, a mod I found on um, race department that I seen of an, of a Dodge D one fifty special. <laughs> this is basically if a Dodge pickup was turned into a thirties like or thirties or fifties thirties Grand Prix car or a fifties like. Um, lane speed record uh, car, basically. Excuse me, if Dodge was around back in, or if Dodge made like a a roadster back in the 30s and ran in a Grand Prix race, this would be the car pretty much. Oh my God! <laughs> but this car, this car right here is actually a monster. Let's say that. So this this car this old Dodge D one fifty special is powered by a six cylinder Cummins. I'm pretty sure it's a five nine liter. Maybe it might be bigger than that. I'm not sure, <clears throat> but it does roughly around nine hundred and eighty one horsepower. So this car has around nine hundred eighty one horsepower and around two hundred and forty or two thousand four hundred forty one. Uh, pound feet of torque <laughs> with this uh, monster of a Cummins engine. Holy jeez! <clears throat> and you can feel it too. If I had to compare this car to anything, and I'd have to compare it to the to the Porsche nine or nine seventeen thirty, the big turbo Panzer, because this thing, when you ha once you have it at and around, or once you get it on full throttle and let the RPMs build up, this thing wants to go around. <laughs> it's just the only thing, di the only difference between the big turbo Panzer is the fact that it has no downforce. It's basically a 30s Grand Prix car, like I said. <clears throat> and, <laughs> I've wanted to do this video for a while, so we're going to finally do it. We're going to take this Dodge D150. <laughs> special out on an orch life and see how fast we can get around it <laughs> oh my god <laughs> this ought to go well so here we are sitting on the back long back straightaway I guess you could say uh, of the orch life and uh, I did a couple practice laps as you can see because this car is a handful to say the least and uh, I lowered the gearing down a bit so I can Oh shit! I mean to put it in gear right away. I did, I put it in uh, 
I lowered the gearing down a bit so I mind the wheel spin a bit. And uh, I should have mentioned before too, I said this is a car is a bit like a 30s Grand Prix car. It pretty much is because this has old brakes, so we're going to be heavy on the brakes and backing off a little bit more than usual. So I signed back here than what I did in the first one to that video so I can show you guys. So I, said, so I compared this to the Porsche 91730 and well, let me show you. I'm just going to pop in third gear and just let the RPMs go up. not gripping the pavement. <laughs> We're going to be sliding around in this car a whole lot, so here we go. Let's get this lap started. Hopefully I can actually do this right. <laughs> I totally don't have to like make a couple attempts to do this. Oh god, no. it's about to not <laughs> get it down one right away. So here we go. I'm gonna just get down a second gear for this. And here we go, starting our lap, here we go. Uh, I probably should have just kept it in third, but oh well. Just keep it in third anyway. Let, uh, not freak up the first turn. Alright, here we go. Half throttle. That's pretty much how we're going to be on this entire track, this entire circuit. Uh, here we go. I don't know why I'm just flunking on the names of the turns now all of a sudden. My brain is now focusing on... I'm trying to keep this thing steady. This is going to be more of a lap of just survival than just actually an actual high lap. Let's have that happen to us. <laughs> Open it up a little bit and then break here. And you see on the brakes for a bit. Ooh, a little bit of lock ups. Let it swing wide, not too wide. There we go. <laughs> the engine building up on this makes you think of like if you're at a truck pull and you see some guy with a Dodge Cummins uh, put to uh, pull the uh, pull the sleigh. Mm -hmm. Alright, get it well down enough for this corner. Alright, and start breaking here because this is going to be a pain in the butt to get turned into. Use a little bit of throttle to steer away from that. Oh, okay. Knew that was going to happen, okay. <laughs> not again, not happening again. As we go down the hill, just flying here. You can, I can really even see over this, it's so long. Get up to mm. It's probably gonna be the only other section we're gonna be keeping it in second. The other one's gonna be the hairpin. That's kind of another reason why lower the gears because part of the same kind of haze of transition from third to second. Get it rolled up here for this little kink here. Oh. If I don't go wide, uh, shush. Hmm. We're just gonna shush it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> or is it too far off the track? We're, we're fine. Oh, I gotta get, get, get rolled over for this. There we go. Not this hairpin, but the next hairpin is what I'm talking about. Down to uh, miss, hit, miss. I guess I never miss. Uh. I'm probably a bad idea keeping it in fourth gear, but screw it. Oh god, I missed that. I missed the apex. Save me to break here. Get it rolled down in a second. Hope it turns. There we go. Like I said, there's so much wheelbase to this car that it doesn't really want to turn well in some places. 
It just wants to go straight. It's like a bullet. Uh, uh, hop to curve a little. Oh, it just seems to wheel spinning all the time, getting some understeer. Alright, I'll right, get a little gear. Get, right. get to the lower PMs line build. Up for him to go to his kink. There we go. Break. Down the third. And this right here, let us open up just a tiny bit, but not too much. It still wants to bring us around. Uh, pretty much give me a half turn all the time, just letting the turbo and the torque of the diesel engine build up and take us around. A little kink here. There we go. Open up just a little bit. Back off as we're just going like, to coast a bit to here. Kind of keep, keep it so it turns a bit. Break here a tiny bit. Cause this is a tight, kind of a tight curve and turn for this car. Oh god. Uh, break a bit. There we go. Turn you pig. There we go. Get break down. Hopefully it breaks. Oh, just barely getting slowed down for that corner. Kind of screwed up a little bit. Coming up to the carousel, so the first carousel. Break here, shift down. Uh, oh, kind of screwed up the carousel a bit. Oh, God. <laughs> just slightly catching it. I had to break there a bit. Oh god. Shoot that back down the third for here. Whoa. Oh, she really wants to sell around all the time. This thing is fun. <laughs> I oh my god, this thing is so cool. Hmm? Huh? Hmm? What the hell's a shaky for a second? What the hell? Okay. Uh, break, 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 please. There you go. Down the YouTube corner. Wait to people. Hi, people. Okay, sign a bit. There we go. Break it down. Oh god. Uh, uh. Alright, get in fourth gear for a bit. Down the hill a bit. Oh god. Uh, please turn, please turn. There you go. And just throw it a little bit. Oh god. Cut. Shh. Nope, we're gonna just cut the track because it's all over the place. Oh my god, I can't keep it straight all of a sudden. What the hell? Alright, up the fourth gear, but let the RPMs build. There you go. Uh, there you go, down the third. And two to the second carousel. Oh god. There you go, second carousel. Here we go. This is gonna be a pain in the ass. Uh, let go. There we go. Not bad, not bad. Uh, don't you spin. Quick shift down. Real quick. Uh, this might be in the 8 minute mark, but we'll see where it is. As we come around the bend, and now we can just let this comments just open right up. It's not going to be the hardest comments. Oh my god. There we go. Straight now, straight now. Ah, we ain't getting it under 8 minutes, but we can at least get it under an 8.30 if we can. Getting up to 200 miles an hour, holy jeez. Uh, might the lift for the key or this bend here under the bridge. Oh, I just got an achievement. Oh, God. Uh, break, please, break, please, break, please. Hello, old brakes. 
Let's get it down for the last portion. Getting a little bit of understeer. Okay. As we just spin it for the line. It's an 834. Holy jeez. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I know you can't see it, but <laughs> I see it because I don't have a camera, but I am really all sweaty. Whew. It is warm in this, in this room right now. Holy hell. <laughs> and now I got the hiccups. That's cool. Oh. Hey. <laughs> what is this thing? <laughs> Just what is this? It's like a modern take of a uh, modern take of a 30s Grand Prix car or like a 50s uh, <laughs> lane speed rec insane lane speed record car. It's <laughs> this thing is insane. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> uh, like I said, this thing could practically match the turbo paints if it had like more downforce to it. <laughs> uh, this guy is pretty fun. Uh, but anyways, guys, I, I'll probably leave this uh, mod in, in the description so you guys can enjoy this and see for yourself how much of a handful this thing is. Cause this thing is a legit handful. I kid you not. I'm pretty sure I can maybe go faster with this car. Or do a faster lap with this, but oh, that's probably the best I can do for now. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, leave a like if you really enjoyed it and thought that really thought the videos. Show show some love for the channel or show some love for the video. Subscribe to see more videos like this, and comment down what uh, other uh, other cars you want to see take on the Norch Life. Um, and, as well as any other video ideas, as well as other games you want to see me play. And yeah. But, anyways, guys, I really. Uh. See. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I lost my wish for a second. <laughs> this has been the Dodge D150 special. This weird long boy. <laughs> uh. I will see you all next time. Have a good day.